Assalamu alaikum today I will show you in this tutorial how to create your custom patron blur you can use your patron and create your custom blur before we start if you don't subscribe my channel please subscribe my channel and click bell icon to receive any new tutorial and don't forget to like and share so let's start first of all I create a floor design uh, which I need you can import image and from AutoCAD file but I want to create in rivet okay I use first of all this model line okay model line I first I draw my design uh, this I 10 meters okay and this I write 5 meters and this 10 meters and 5 just I want to show you this uh, floor how to design uh, your custom floor okay this is 10 by 5 this is my floor okay now I create here uh, design according to your project this is not uh, necessary to what I create uh, you follow the same this is you have to you have to draw your design this model line okay and I create upset point point two point two and this pellet okay and upset point two and pellet and select this and mirror. okay again model line click this pick line and upset point four I write for 40 centimeter okay and here and here this is create this pellet okay select this and mirror okay and select this and mirror okay so I delete this line I delete this line okay so now this is my floor uh, design okay and this is up to you you create your own design uh, as per your uh, length and width okay as a floor okay so now I want to create here material and uh, so what I do first of all I click architecture and click the floor okay this uh, edit type okay uh, duplicate I write a floor one okay and I change here the 
this two okay this floor uh, thickness two okay so okay and I drop this right this pick line <coughs> first of all I write to draw this okay this is floor one okay and I click finish okay <coughs> this is floor one again floor edit type duplicate here floor 2 already here come floor 2 and you can rename uh, floor uh, any uh, if, if you uh, want any name so it's up to you is floor 2 okay and okay so now I create this pick line and click this one click this one click this one click this okay so I right click here finish edit model okay this is floor 2 after the uh, first I finish this all and after that I create a material so now this is uh, floor 1 and th this is floor 1 and this is floor 2 okay the same way go to floor and uh, edit type duplicate now floor 3 okay already come floor 3 and if you want to rename it's okay okay uh, click uh, here pick line okay I this is floor 3 okay click click this click and finish okay this is floor 3 so okay so now I want to create the border this floor okay go to floor and duplicate uh, edit type and duplicate the floor this floor four okay and okay this pick line click this one click this one click this boundary okay and click this inside which i no need because this is the other type of floor okay if I don't select this uh, corner so this floor will be make this all so the design will not appear so you should understand this why I click okay okay now this floor is uh, create okay now I want to apply material is one by one uh, first of all I click this floor one and type edit click this edit and by category and I create a new material I rename this floor floor one okay and click this appearance click this and where is your uh, texture you want to apply so I keep in this desktop okay I apply this okay this granite and okay again and okay see this is apply now you can adjust this I click this edit type and this by category floor one I click this one and you can change the right here one meter one meter done okay 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 and again I select this floor 2 edit type 
and edit you can change this before uh, uh, before we create this floor uh, it's up to you you change the material same uh, I rename this material F2 it's mean floor 2 and appearance I click here uh, this material I select open apply ok ok and ok so this material is apply and again I click this floor 3 edit type and click edit by category uh, again click uh, new material and I rename this F3 it's mean floor 3 okay it's up to you you change any name you want so I click this material or apply okay okay and okay so this is material is apply this uh, you know this uh, is very small size you can change uh, the first one I change a little bit so and again this click floor pour edit type edit and by category and create a new material I rename this floor for okay and I click this material I don't know which material before I okay this is not apply okay and okay and okay so this floor is create as per your design uh, click this realistic and go to 3d this is now finished as per your design i hope you like this tutorial